Hi guys, I get contacted pretty regularly for PR. I don't accept most of their offers. I only accept things that are relevant to my lifestyle or re relevant to my channel or both. And so when a company contacts me, I always research them to make sure that they are a legitimate company and to make sure that they are offering good products. Recently, I was contacted by a company called Just For Kira. They make colored contacts. And while I have blue eyes, I've had blue eyes my entire life. And I do love the fact that I do have blue eyes. But sometimes it's fun just to try different things and um, play around with color. And I feel like some eyeshadow looks better on other colors of eyes other than blue and that kind of thing. So when they offered to send me four pairs of contacts for free in exchange for a review, I jumped on it. I was like, yeah, that sounds fun. So I did do some research beforehand before I accepted and they are an FDA approved company. These are colored contacts. These are uh, prescription colored contacts. And noticing as I'm going through the site, they're all very natural looking. They don't have any crazy things like Halloween type contacts. These are all very natural looking. They have shades of blue, green, brown, uh, gray. They have all different colors and they're very pretty, very pretty. The first thing that I noticed when I was on their site was the fact that their prices are very reasonable. Their regular price of their contacts are very reasonable. They are having a summer sale right now. Also, if you use my code Andy21, then you can receive 20% off of your first order. So I'm going to unbox this. I have not opened it yet. I'm going to unbox it and we're going to see what we have here. So right off, there is a card that says, thank you for your order. Now we have a chance to, now you have a chance to get free products. We'll randomly select lucky customers every month and give away our best selling products. It tells you how to participate. It also has a sheet, how to put in your contacts, how to remove your contacts. These are all good for a year. After you open them, the contacts are good for a year. Now they also come with, since I got four different colors, they came with four contact cases. looks like there's something else in there. It looks like there's a, oh, it has the little suction cup to help you put your contacts in if you're not comfortable with, you know, using your finger. Also, it looks like there's a pair of tweezers in there. I thought I was going to have to go buy four different contact cases, but I don't. Like I said, they're good for a year. The first ones that I got are called I think it's Sewin. It's S W I N S I W I N Choco. So they are a chocolate brown. I tried to get the, the darkest brown that they have because I wasn't sure how they would go over my blue eyes. And those are Mirage color. The next ones I got are called Vision Gray. That is what that looks like. And this is their um, Abicons. Abicons? I don't know very reflective. So those are vision gray. Um, I did look to see if I could do like describe them like from the description box, but there wasn't really anything in the description box. But as you see, I'm putting the picture of what they look like um, on the site. Also, I have ginger pink. So I thought maybe that the pink ones on top of the blue on top of my blue eyes would maybe look, um, make it purple, blue and pink, maybe look purple or a lilac or a lavender or something. I thought that would be fun. And then the last one I got are ginger green. And I tried to get something that was very green, but very natural looking green, which almost all of, I mean, I saw, I went through the site for so long and everything is a very natural looking color, very natural looking. So uh, these are also the Mirage. They're all Mirage except for this one right here, which was the Vision Gray. So now that I unbox them for you, I'm going to do a try on. So I hope you enjoy them and I will be back at the end to tell you what I think of them.
Okay, you guys, so that was my try on. So now is my honest review. I have told you many times, I will always be honest with you. I'm not going to say that I love something just because it was given to me in PR. I won't do that. Um, I am giving you an honest review. Um, the pros, they are very comfortable. Uh, they seem like they're very good quality. I've been wearing contacts since I was a sophomore in high school, so over 30 years uh, that I have been wearing contacts, and they were very comfortable, very good quality. I can tell that they're a very good quality contact. Um, they were packaged extremely well. The little, the little thing that they came in was sealed very tight, and they were they were packaged extremely well. Um, the cons. I don't feel like they were very pigmented. Um, I tried to choose the ones that were the most pigmented, the most opaque. Now that could be on me. I maybe didn't choose the right ones for me, but other than the green, I thought the green was very noticeable. You could really see the green, um, on my eyes. You could see them, but the brown is the one that I was the most excited about because I wanted to see what I look like with brown eyes. And I felt like it looked like I had hazel eyes because the brown was not opaque. It was not very pigmented and you could still see my blue eyes underneath. Um, the gray, if you look at the contact, the gray is very light, is extremely light. And maybe my eyes are too dark for that gray because I didn't feel like it made my eyes look gray at all. The, I will put up a picture of the model. Uh, she looked like she had gray eyes and that was very exciting to me. I wanted that for, especially for like the winter or whatever. Um, the pink, I was a little disappointed in as well because, um, although I feel like it did make my eyes look a little bit, um, purple ish the pink with the blue. I think my eyes are maybe a little too dark for those contacts, except for the green ones, except for the green ones. I feel like my eyes are a little too dark. Uh, and I don't have dark eyes. My eyes, my blue is about a medium blue. I've seen people that have a lot darker blue eyes than I do, but I think if you have a light eye, if you have a light blue or a light green or maybe a light hazel, or maybe even like a gray um, eye color, these might be a better thing for you. They might uh, look more pigmented to you and, um, or for you. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little disappointed. I'm a little disappointed with the, uh, the colors on my eyes. I thought that they were going to, like I said, I thought they were going to be a little bit more opaque and where you could you know, you couldn't see the blue underneath. Um, I remember I did try on brown contacts at the eye doctor years and years ago, and I could still see the blue. And I was just like, I just want to, I just want to look like, see what I have with <laughs> what I look like with brown eyes. But yeah, um, I am thankful for Sophie. Sophie was my contact. I'm thankful for Sophie for sending me, uh, these contacts and letting me try them out. She was very friendly. She was very professional and I enjoyed working with her. So you guys, thanks so much for joining me today for my Just For Kira unboxing and my contact, colored contact try on. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Let me know if what you thought of the individual uh, colors. So let me know what you think of that. And let me know if you think, um, if you thought they were more pigmented than I think they are, uh, I'm going to wait and see if, when I watch the video back, maybe. But me just looking into the camera viewfinder, uh, they just didn't look very pigmented to me. They didn't. Don't forget, I do have a code, Andy21, and it will save you 20% off of your first order. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I really appreciate you being here. And until our next adventure, everyone have a great day, and we'll see you later.